In this video, I'm basically going to be showing you guys how to change your grade in Prodigy. Hey, what's going on everyone? One Dr. Jeans here and welcome back to our Prodigy video. Now you may be wondering, why do I need to change my grade? Well maybe, you're on a very high grade level and you're kind of getting annoyed because you can't complete questions fast enough and your runs are getting destroyed. So in this case, I'm going to be showing you guys how to change your grade level in Prodigy, right guys? So now right now you guys can see I'm logged on into my accounts. So now in order to change your grade level, you either have to have one of the two things. You either need a parent's account or you need a teacher account. Now these are the only two ways to force Prodigy to change your grade level. Now if you guys have a parent or teacher account, what you guys have to do is you have to add your child to your account. And once you guys do that, what you guys can do is you can just go over there, right guys? So now let me quickly show you, right? So now what you guys want to do is you want to log into your parents' account or ask your parents to log into their account and then change your grade. So yeah. So right, you just go over to Prodigy's website over here and ask them to log in, right? So log in, bam. And now we're gonna first start off with the parents' account. Now once you guys log in with your parents' account, you guys will see you're basically given all of the things, all of your um children which you have over here. Right now, there are six people in the, uh, linked with this parent account, so what you guys can do is you can see all of their grade mentioned over here. So now, what you can do is you can click on their accounts, like view progress, right? And when you go to view progress, what you guys want to do is you want to go to manage child, and right over here, by the side, it says grade overwrites, right? Now, basically, it tells you everything which you need to do, and you basically click over here and change your grade, right? Maybe you want to force your child to learn sixth grade. Bam! Fifth. Bam! Fourth. Bam! Three. Two, one. Yeah, you guys get the point. So basically, over here, what you guys can do is you can override the grade and force Prodigy to force this type of math onto you, or you can click no override, which will set it back to its normal one. Right. So now this basically works with nearly all of the accounts, and you guys can see um, the grade actually depends on where your account is made. Right. Now, if you guys are wondering why all of the names are blurred, it's because I'm not stupid. I'm not gonna show my Prodigy username. Like, who does that? <laughs> Right, but if you're wondering how this says curriculum fourth over here and this says curriculum class first, well that's because these um, classes automatically adjust to which country you're in, so you'd have to go to view progress, and it's really the same thing no matter where you are, you just change the curriculum. But yeah, so basically you guys can mess around with accounts like this, so you can change your grade. Now this is the first way. Um, perhaps you're like, you know what, parents account, too complicated, give me an easier method. Teacher account. Alright, so make yourself a teacher account. Once you guys make a teacher account, add your students into the account. And if you guys are wondering how to add your students into your parents' account, you guys can see there's an add child button over here. And it's literally the first thing which you guys do. But for the teacher account, let me quickly show you how to do that. Alright guys, now the thing about the teacher account is you guys can have multiple classes in a single teacher account. Right guys? Now over here you guys can see I have like nine different classes in this account right so now you guys can see all of them are, are um, arranged according to grade and you guys can tell there are people in it so now you may be wondering how do I add students to a class well basically what you guys do is you take the class code over here and basically put it in well the class code section while you log in right so if you log into Proch, you guys can see that over here you have an option to join a class code so basically if you want to add students what you guys can do is you can basically link their accounts by following these steps over here right so basically, once you add your account to your teacher account, what you guys can do is teacher account to change anyone else's grade. Like, over here, we can change this to 5th. Now, if you guys are wondering whose accounts are these, right now, all of the accounts which grades I'm changing are actually all of mine. So no one's account is getting hurt in this process of making this video. So right, this is basically how you change your grade. Now, if you log back into Prodigy, I do believe our grade should be at 1st grade, right? Yeah, please check once again. <laughs> Alright, yeah, it seems like I set it to 8th grade. Whoa, that's way too high. Manage child and let's set that to first grade. Yep, bam, bada bing bong bang. Right, so now our grade is set back to first grade, and now what we can do is we can log out and go into our account. And if you guys do a battle, you guys will see that the grade has been changed to first. Right, so now I really don't make these types of videos. Mostly my videos are tutorials in Prodigy, but I will be making some videos on like how to like do stuff around Prodigy and the stuff as well. So yeah. Get ready for more tutorials, this may or may not be because I managed to break my computer and I have to get, like, get something working, so yeah. Right now, this is all I can do. <laughs> right, so now over here you guys can see we found some magical eggs, so let's go into battle and see what happens. Wizards battle! Right, let's see what happens. Here we go, loading up and bam. 
right now, so if you cast our spells over here, you guys will see that it clearly shows us this is a first grade question, right? You guys can tell that our grade card reset to first. So basically, this forces Prodigy onto that grade, and I do believe Prodigy does not change grades until you've completely finished that grade. Or if you finish that grade, then it won't change at all. So yeah, there you guys go. That's how you change your grade level to whatever grade you want. Maybe you're like, fifth grade is too easy for me. Change it to eighth. Well, there you guys go. You can do that. And yeah, so guys, I hope you guys found this video informational and entertaining. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up. And yeah, merch store may or may not be coming soon. So see y'all next time. Have a good time.